My Piano Secret, starring Gary Moore. Thanks again, and welcome, dear friends, to another edition of I've Got a Secret on a somewhat sopping and soggy night here in New York City. I would like, however, to have you meet the members of our panel before we start. First, there is Bill Cullen, and Betsy Palmer, and Henry Morgan, and <laughs> finally, Bess Meyerson. That's our panel. Henry, are you glad to see you tonight? <laughs> Not particularly. Not yeah. particularly. Are you ready to play the game? Yeah, that applause, though, I wasn't glad. I was just faking it. <laughs> well, you say you're ready to play the game, but I rather doubt it, panel, because to start to play, we have to first put on our blindfolds. Yeah, ready? And you may take your blindfolds off at the end of your own particular questioning period. You mind if I check mine? Yes, to make sure oh, the yeah. water is <laughs> off of it. The last time there was <laughs> the equivalent of ink on it. All right, now with blindfolds in place, may we greet our first contestant, please. I very nearly just spilled the beans and called him by his name. We will call this gentleman Mr. X. Mr. X. But before we ask Mr. X to reveal his secret, we're going to need the services of a volunteer. And Bess, you'll be terribly surprised to know that you just volunteered. I didn't. I heard you just so clearly. Would you take your shoes off? Oh, I'm glad to you. Take your shoes off. I keep your blindfold on. Shoes today. Yes, sir. And entrust yourself to me. I will Completely. lead you upstairs. You promise. Yes, I promise you. If you will rise, you know you're in tender, loving hands. Come with me. I would do you no ill. I would ah. sooner harm ah. myself. Just keep coming. Now, Bess, I'm going to turn you around and ask you to back up about uh, two or three feet until you, uh, there, you're on the landing strip. What? Lower your landing gear and you're in. Never been called that before. <laughs> now, uh, Mr. X will take care of your shoulders. Trust me with your... Don't drop me, Gary. I promise you we won't. We're just going to lay you out nice and comfortably. It's the appendix right, right. here. <laughs> Oh, are you comfortable? Oh, I couldn't be more comfortable. Well, I could, but... <laughs> All right, well, Fine. just don't be nervous about anything that happens because oh, you don't are in... cover me up. I You're... feel like I'm being put away. <laughs> <laughs> well, you'd be the prettiest one I've seen ever in all my life. There we are. Now, I am going to ask Mr. X, please, to reveal his secret to me and at the same time to you at home, sir. Well, that's pretty exciting, but it doesn't look to me as though she is. Hmm? Yeah. You, you, you're, you're sure? Mm-hmm. All right. I hope so. Whoops. There you go. <laughs> no. <get> shave. <laughs> <laughs> and here, too? All right. panel is concerned something that is happening, and we'll start the questioning with Bill Cullen, please. Well, I'll ask the obvious, Gary, to get it out of the way. Is it happening to Bess? Yes. Is it pleasant for Bess? I should think it would be oh, it's delightful. Lovely, Bill. delightful. Oh, really nice? Oh, it's fun. More laughs. Why did you have to take off your shoes to do it? Uh, all questions must be oh. answerable by yes or no. Could you have done this, or could Bess have done this without removing her shoes? Yes, but it wouldn't be as much fun. Yeah. Oh, you should see my toes going. In other words, I'd like to skip the next question. Uh, <laughs> oh, go ahead. Are, uh, Gary said he was going to lay you out. Are you in a horizontal position, Bess? I'm not supposed to ask. Oh, uh, Gary questions. is best in a horizontal position. <laughs> Let's ask Mr. X. Mr. X is best in a horizontal yes. position. Yes. Uh, All right, twenty dollars gone, sixty to go, and we go. You may remove your blindfold, Bill. Yes. And we go from Bill Cullen. <laughs> Oh, Bess, that's ridiculous. Stop that. <laughs> Even Bess doesn't know. We go from Bill Cullen to Betsy Palmer, please. Mr. X, um, is what? this something that you're doing to Bess? Um, does it have to do with um, being a magician? Yes. 
I... Oh. Is she suspended in midair between two chairs or something? No, she's no. not suspended in midair no. between two chairs. Well, if she's horizontal, are you sawing her in half, Mr. X? Not yet, honey. <laughs> yes, and she is now two of the best friends I have. Really? She no, is not... sawed in half? No, I was kidding. Um, are you doing something, an, an optical illusion it is uh, to the audience? It's an illusion. <laughs> It's an... All right, there's forty dollars down, forty dollars to go. Uh, Betsy, you may remove your your blindfold. As a matter of fact, uh, it, you say you're, that you're dubious about it. Oh. I frankly am too. Let's uh, lend a little more credence to this secret, huh? I wish I was Beth. Why, dear? Oh, Beth, we'll you don't know what's out. happening to you. Really? <laughs> what? What? Watch the dress. It's marvelous. <laughs> I like your new dress you've got on there. <laughs> There you go. All right, Henry Morgan, you're up next. Well, um, Mr. X, uh, are you a magician? Yes. Do I know you? I've met you. How are you? Fine, thanks. <laughs> Is best a sort of floating in air? Yes. I think that we Am have to I? say that's it. Yes, we have to you say are. That's it. <laughs> that's it, Bess. That's it. But, and, and look, for the benefit of the panel, for the benefit of all... No, all right, we, we, I guess time, time, will, time will run us out. Bess, dear girl, Yes. again, we're going to have to uh, ask you to let us have the cloth. Am I lighter than air? Bess, You're lighter marvelous. than almost anything. I wish you could. What, go. Betsy? Marvelous. Careful. 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 What do I do? Do I stay down? Yep. <coughs> I can't see, though. <laughs> Something has gone wild. Something has gone Oh. I'm glad I'm not there, Betty. Great. Are you all right, Gary? Yeah, I'm all right. Yeah. I'm not lighter than that. Melbourne, don't, don't stop. Going! <laughs> all right. Perfectly all right. Perfectly all right. Perfectly all right. Oh, let's get the legs down here. Yeah. Modesty is being preserved. I'm in front of you. Remove your blindfold to your right. You will find one of the world's most famous magicians, Mr. Milburn Christopher. Hello, how are you? <laughs> the panel will vouch for it. They saw with their own eyes you were suspended in midair. You were flying. Really? I was flying. Just, flying. just flying. It felt great. Good. You may watch the. the a bit. We thought we'd add a little suspense at the finish. I see. That was my spine, there. <laughs> Best we'll see you. See you over there.